This is code.org, CS Discoveries or Computer Science Discoveries. This is lesson 10, obviously. It's part of unit two, which is their web development unit or their uh, unit, uh, their web development unit, unit two of your teacher. Lesson 10 is styling text with CSS. So it's about CSS and this is styling text. Let's see what they're having us do. CSS and text color. This HTML file uses a style sheet, style.css, and that's way down over here, to give the page a particular style. That makes sense. The style sheet contains information about what each of the HTML elements should look like. Find the code in the style sheet. Click on style.css in the files list. Okay, let's click on that. That is making the heading the H1 heading red. Well, it says H1 here, and that says color red, so I would, I mean, I think it's that. Change the, co change the code co for the color of the H1 from red to a different heading. Oh, we can just pick. Hmm. Um, I don't know. Let's do purple. Oh, wow. It worked. Ooh, it even lists stuff. Medium purple? Ooh. Ooh, I like M&Ms. Ooh, let's pick green. M&Ms are giving me ideas. Green. Oh, that's kind of cool. Orange. Oh, yeah. So that's what they're using to change that. And I bet I'm going to try something real quick. Let's just add it. It didn't ask us to do this, but let's just, let's see if it will work if we just add it down here. Oh, it even suggests colors. Um, but I want this one to be yellow because I want it hard to read, I guess. Let's see. Oh, that didn't. What did I do different? Oh, is that not a paragraph? Oh, that's a paragraph. Ooh, that is hard to read. Cool. But I guess you get the point. So how to change it is you're changing the color in the CSS sheet. And so this is H1 tag. It must change anything that is H1. So I bet odd, yep, is H1. That's what it has an impact on. Cool. Okay, that makes sense. Let's keep going. 